Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you how you can find uh, files of certain file size in your SharePoint environment. So here's a use case. Uh, I need to find some large files. Maybe I need to see if I have some large files on my SharePoint tenant because I maybe want to delete them, right? They take way too, too much space or something like that. So, you know, generally when you execute a search, let's just execute a search, right? Um, and it gives me all these different uh, characteristics, you know, here, right? Um, uh, you know, filters, I should say, and I can filter by file type and last modified, but it doesn't give me the file size, right? I cannot, you know, filter by small files, large files, and so on. So uh, what we are going to do in this case, we are going to rely on a, a managed property here called size, all right? And the formula is you just type in size and then, you know, less or, you know, more symbol. So I'm looking for all the documents uh, that are larger, let's just say, you know, 40 megabytes, all right? Now, you have to type in, uh, you cannot just, you know, type in 40 megabytes here. You have to type in in the terms in bytes, all right, in bytes. So I added uh, a total of uh, six zeros at the end. And let's see what the search result is. Here we go, all right, it gave me some files. And by the way, if uh, obviously I only have a few video files here, but if I had some large, I don't know, PDFs or some other types of files, I would be able to filter them uh, accordingly. Now it's worth mentioning is that um, you know, when you type in, let's say, 1,000 here, 1 million, it's not, uh, you know, it's not, uh, you know, kind of just one. If you're looking, let's say, for 40 uh, megabyte a file, it's not, um, you know, 40 and then, you know, six zeros at the end uh, because uh, one kilobyte is actually equal to 1,024 bytes. So uh, there is a, a bit of a... Uh, I guess adjustment there, but for the purpose of this uh, demonstration, um, uh, essentially uh, I just typed in a bunch of zeros. But just keep in mind that uh, you know one uh, kilobyte is equal to 1,024 bytes. All right, so whatever the number you put in here, that will actually result in a, a little bit smaller number of uh, megabytes. All right, uh, but other than that, I mean, yeah, you can actually see. Let's double check here so i'm going to open this file and just to show you uh the proof so here are my actual files that it found and as you can see all right they uh, uh they are all pretty much you know above uh you know 40 you know megabytes so it did its uh, job all right and um yeah that's uh, pretty much it it's uh, nice and easy um again you can use uh, this specific you know formula obviously you can use the less symbol uh, if you want, or even an equal symbol. Uh, but this is a nice way to find uh, uh, documents uh, quickly uh, that are larger, you know, that are of certain file size. And you can, I did this trick on the, of course, on the main SharePoint start page, but you can obviously execute the same trick in a, in a library search. All right, you can do the same trick at the site level or hub, you know, hub site, uh, you know, uh, search. So it doesn't really matter, the result is going to be the same. So that's all I wanted to mention in this video. Uh, as always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a, have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.